Hey guys, Basil here with BTECT and you're watching my Huawei Nova unboxing video. We unboxed the Nova Plus yesterday, so if you haven't seen that, check it out. The Nova Plus is a 5.5 inch screen phone versus a five inch Huawei Nova, but otherwise they're very, very similar in terms of specs. Very different designs though. So let's take a look at the design by jumping inside the box after we take a look at the key highlights. And really it's just that holographic strip on the front. Um, which says Huawei Nova and Huawei Design. I can't stress enough how much these two phones feel like flagships, but obviously they are high mid ranges. Now, taking a look around the back, you can slice open and pull out, and ta da! We have the Huawei Nova. This is a very similar style box to the um, Honor 8 side in, so we can yank that out and you can see there's all the other stuff in there as well. Put that to the side and we can take the plastic off the Nova. Let's try pulling it that way. Perfect. And we'll power it up. We can take a closer look at the device shortly, but first thing we wanna do is get rid of that. And no, there doesn't appear to be any plastic over the top. So what's inside the box? You can. See, the bigger box of the two contains a SIM card, eject pin, a USB Type-C, and a power brick as well. Put that to the one side, and the smaller of the two contains nothing, because it's a pre-production unit. Interestingly, the Nova Plus contains some headphones. This doesn't, um, or it doesn't look like it doesn't, but that might change in final retail uh, boxing. So, taking a quick look at the phone, again, five inches of full HD screen, IPS screen technology. The right hand side is where you've got the power button and it's really nicely accented. It's quite dark in this room, we couldn't get any better lighting for this, but it's accented with red, which you can see in our hands on. You've also got the USB type C at the base, left hand side, no buttons, just the SIM, slot, SIM card slot, and up at the top is your 3.5 mil jack. Priced similarly to the Honor 8, it's gonna be a real interesting uh, question to see which device A is better and which device people end up going for en masse. Having just unboxed them properly and taken a look around the UI for about 10 minutes, I can give you some more conclusive first impressions. And they are undeniably expensive, but there isn't actually anything in the kind of five inch screen smartphone size other than the iPhone or the Sony Xperia X, um, which has this kind of like really great design, but metal frame. And of course the HTC One A9, can't forget that. It's absolutely beautiful. So there is a trend that manufacturers are going to, which is just having some more expensive, more premium finished mid-range spec devices for everyone who doesn't care about specs. And unlike me and you guys probably watching this, not everyone is the YouTube generation of uh, tech head viewers who want to have their Snapdragon 820s, etc. I personally prefer the Nova in terms of the design. The screen, the 5.5 inch screen of the Nova Plus looks perfect. Obviously you've got that image stabilization on the camera but the camera bump and generally the whole phone just feels a little bit older, a little bit like a Mate rather than the Nova, which feels like a redefined uh, sorry, Nexus 6P, which for me is sweet. That was a beautiful device. My one issue with it was it was way too big. What do you guys think, Nova or Nova Plus or neither Novas? Let us know in the comments section below. Like the video, click like, like the channel, subscribe. It's how you stay on top of everything we do. Thanks for watching, BTECT.